practice dummies. This attack dummy appears to have been a great, seen a great deal of use. And another one. Another one. And we have a chest. And he left a drop for us. Let's see what we got here. Armor, long sword, plus one. Heavy shield, plus one. Pack is heavier than I am. Let's see what the armor is. Pass that off to Peldor. Let's give this other stuff to Broy. You have need of me. Bathed in blood. Heavy armor, at plus three. Wow. Hmm. No. I am certain. Max dex bonus is one, so it's not a good idea to give it to him. What Walk about? In my step. Follow me. Yeah, we can change out this mithril field plate. That would give us twenty-seven, and we can sell that stuff. Yes. What is it? Let's see. Actually, he could probably wear this though. Armor class nine. That's eight. Hmm. I think I'm just going to leave that one on for now. Let's go check this chest. Yes. Oh, there's all kinds of stuff in here. Bastard sword, short sword, war mace. Nothing's magical. I'm just going to leave it. It's on the shelf. A case full of war medals from the Sembian army. Potions. We'll take all them. Duskwood Plank, we can sell that. Mithro Ingot, we can sell that. Full Strength, pass that to Broy. Speed, pass that to Broy. Cat's Grace, we'll give that to Peldor. Follow me, now. Alright, let's go to the next room. Yeah, there's the cook we talked to before. And let's check this room. Jennifer. Hello there. Hello. Well met. May I have the pleasure of your name? My name is Jennifer. That's a beautiful name for a beautiful woman, but what happened to your eye, Jennifer? I accidentally fell down the stairs. Should probably be more careful. Hello there. So what really happened to your eye? Please don't hurt him. It's not Marquez's fault. It's mine, really. I shouldn't have made him angry. How did you make him angry? I spoke to him in drow. It was wrong of me. Well, it certainly doesn't warrant Mark if beaten you. You want me to take care of him for you? No, please don't. Whatever he's done, you must promise me you won't hurt him. Okay, I promise. Thank you. I understand why you're here. It has something to do with Bukellan, doesn't it? Listen, I know this will sound crazy, but I'm sure that Mark if could be a better person somehow if he could just get out of here. If you want to break up Pokellan's army, you'll need each of the lieutenant's badges. Marketh is one. They open an invisible barrier at the back of the fallen temple. Brother P Perdium and his undead fellows watch over it. Whatever you need to do, please don't hurt Marketh. It's not his fault that he does bad things. Hmm. Hello there. How did you wind up here? I should have seen it coming. I abused Malavon constantly while he was growing up. When Reverend Brother Pokellan and his lieutenants met with my people, I slighted Marketh. I wouldn't speak to him because he was male. Instead, I spoke to Maiden Nomadia. After long discussion, our city could not, could find no reason to ally with Pokellan. Unlike the rest of my people, Malavon wanted to join with Brother Reverend Brother. I discussed this, so he abducted me and took me to Marketh for safekeeping. They eventually found out anyways. Now Pokellan is planning some sort of assault on my former home, and I am here with Marketh. Why don't you just leave? My brother Malavon, he placed a series of spells on me. If I ever cross the boundaries of the palace, 
The first two spells will destroy my natural resistance to magic. The third spell will extinguish my life force. Jinifei, I found this potion. It destroys magical effects on people who drink it. Do you think that you could use it to remove Malavon's contingency spells? I could, but I need to stay here with Marketh. He needs me. Thank you for your help, Bill. Hmm. Maybe if we kill Marketh, she'll leave. Well, at least we know what that potion's for now. No, uh, let's see. Where is that potion, anyways? Yeah, right here. Oil of Null Effect. That's the stuff that should help her. And we got another door. Let's look in this one. And we have Flozum. It's very similar to the other guy's name. And we have a table here. What is this? This is a drafting table. And a lockbox. What's in here? Glowing Earth Essence. And another practice dummy. And a bookcase. Books on this shelf range from a brief history of Schult to magical theory and practice. And some potions. And some more potions. This bookshelf ranges from battle in ancient Cormier to mysteries of deep moon sea. Let's take a look at those items here. Fox is cunning. Let's give that to Peldor. Death armor. We go to Broy. Vigor. We go to Broy. Okay, so let's do a quick save. Let's see what Flozum has to say. Who are you? I am Flozum. Who are you? You're the one who drew the portrait of Marketh, aren't you? Yeah, so what? Uh, I just thought it was nice, that's all. Thanks. What are you doing here, anyways? I'll be leaving nothing. Okay. Maybe we'll deal with him later. Let's continue on. And the stairway going up. Well, let's go up. Palace level 2. Let's do a quick save. Alright, let's see what we got up here. A most palpable touch. And a thief. And he's going right for my damn wizard. Of course I can. Right, Eric, kill him. Where's that other one at? Let's get behind this guy. Thieves getting behind thieves. Alright, we got a big room here. Stand still so I can hit you! Oh, let's get this guy. Get some. Alright, looks like he took that guy out. Look at the map here. Let's look in this small room real quick. Nothing in here. Workbench. This desk is covered with meticulously arranged thieves tools. Files, hammers, small blades, and various picks have been placed according to size and length. Alright, oh. Let's get over here. Now oh, where the hell is he running to? Another one back here. And we got a door here. Let's look in there. 
Who's this? Oh, there's Marketh. Alright, let's do a quick save. And let's go talk to him. Greetings. Well, well, what have we here? To whom do I owe the pleasure of this visit? I'm called Broishand. Who are you? I am Lord Chamberlain Marketh. I'm responsible for making sure that New Dorn's Deep runs efficiently, among other things. Lord Chamberlain? New Dorn's Deep? That's a little pretentious, don't you think? Certainly not. We believe that New Dorn's Deep is going to be the center of a very impressive community in the coming years. A community which the dwarves will have no part in, of course. We live in a dream world, Marketh. Ah, uh, but this dream will come true, my friends. There's nothing anyone can do to stop it. Now, if you'll excuse, if you excuse me, I have some business to attend to. You don't get it, do you, Marketh? I came here for your badge. You're not going anywhere until I until you hand it over. You know, you look like a reasonable person. I'm just a thief. I'm not looking for a fight. I don't suppose there's any chance you'd just make take the badge and let me go, is there? Yes, actually, I promised Ginefei I wouldn't hurt you. Hand over a badge and I'll let you go. Ah, oh, what a sweet girl she is. Very well. Say goodbye to Pokellen for me. Okay. We got a badge and... 1,950 experience points. Okay, so I suspect this, this on, place Slowpoke. is probably going to be Keep trapped. Up. So let's go search mode. see what we got here in the chest. Potions. More potions. More potions. And a fireplace. Eerie statues of four serving maids flank this fireplace. The statues are clearly not of dwarven make. Let's see what's on the bookcase. Empty. Masks display. Odd masks line the walls of his room. Their features are void of emotion. Cabinet with a firebomb and some crafting materials. And a lockbox. And some more potions. Right, let's take a look at all this junk we found. Potion of invisibility. Unidentified potion. Let's give that to Peldor. Potion of bless. Lesser Vigor, Barkskin, Cure Critical, Lesser Restoration, Speed, let's give that to Broy. Alright, I guess I'll keep all those I potions certain. there. Potion of Vigor. Alright, so we got Marquette's Badge. And let's take a look down here. Oh, who's this? Kraken Society Mage. Let's go get him. Get behind and do some backstabbing. Oh, Dire Bear. Let's see what Not we got. Hard. There's the spells here. Let's do some lesser dispel on them. I've got them spotted. Here. All right, it's gonna be like that. I will do what I can. Target grappled. And let's see. Do some dispel magic. Yeah. And get some of them defenses off of him. Right boy, can you see him now? Alright, guess we're gonna have to take care of him. Alright, let's 
Let's go back to him. On your guard. Foes approach. All right, taking some damage. And that wizard went down. Let's see what do we have? some of this portion of vigor here. And we got another thief back here. Let's go get him. Yes, yes, yes. And another one walking around back here. A couple of them. And some more over there. Oh, we gotta search these bodies. What the hell is Broy doing? He's dazed. All right, let's go pick up these remains. Some braciers and a dark steel dagger. And there's Seth. Armor bracier, salamander's tongue. Cannot travel quickly carrying all this. Let's see what we got here. Braciers of armor four. Hmm. Dark steel dagger. Let's sell that. Studded leather plus two, let's sell that. Potion of Fox's Cunning, Gauntlets of Elven Might. Only usable with Barbarian, Fighter, Paladin, Ranger, Armor Class bonus one, Strength plus two, and Saving Throw increase. That's going to Broy. The Salamander's Tongue, another dagger it looks like. Dagger plus three fire damage. Improved saving throws versus poison poison and fire immunity ten percent. Hmm, let's give that yes. to Eric. What was this fire kiss? This is plus three and on hit does inferno. And it does shroud of flame. Got a lot of nice daggers.